Hey guys, so this is a very exciting video for me and um, yeah, I've been wanting this forever and it was super expensive but finally I got it from Best Buy so here's what it is it's still in the bag so this is gonna be an unboxing video Best Buy bag and what I got is a DSLR camera and it's the Canon Rebel T6i and this is the video creator kit because look at this it comes with a microphone by Rode I believe this is what it is I'll put the price but it was under 900 yes I can't think of it now because I'm too excited but this is what it looks like and there's a road mic right there so the sound quality is gonna be amazeball but let me tell you guys what um, happened when I was trying to buy the camera and the process and stuff so we'll keep the suspense until I will decide to open the camera and show you guys all the goodies so initially I ordered um, the Canon Rebel T6 I found it on my research because I've been staring at, at it for months and months and months, years even. And um, I bought it the first day last week. And then the next day I was like, do I really want it? Do I really need it? So then I went to Best Buy last weekend and told him to cancel. And then like the next day, um, my friend texted me and she got that same thing as a gift from her husband. And I'm like, ooh. Oh, shit and I told her that's what I got yesterday but then I was like being um, special and I decided to return it because it didn't have a flip screen the T6 does not come with a flip screen and I didn't want to stress about connecting and stuff but then she told me you can still connect and um, through your iPhone and your laptop so then that next day I reordered it and picked it up at the Best Buy closer to my um, location job so then I get home get super excited um, it was beautiful and I even did an unboxing with Ava and I'm um, playing around with it the pictures came out beautiful and then when it came to video it looks amazing but I was still trying to like figure out all the settings which is really confusing like you gotta read a book and you gotta like Google and watch YouTube videos it helps so like until like late evening on Thursday I'm like the day before too and the day after I played around with it when I recorded um video was good besides you know the background lighting was not as great so I, ha I got that fixed kind I think and then when you upload the video or when you listen to your videos on the camera the sound quality was like horrible like the background hissing sound was so loud that it I'm like no no and then the next day I'm like still playing and also I upload the videos on YouTube just to see and then I edit my videos on iMovie which what which is what I've been using and trying to reduce the background noise it worked but then the sound sounded like so wobbly and shaky and like it wasn't like good quality even like nothing compared to this iPhone right now like when you're hearing me it was nothing like that and I'm like okay so I'm gonna need to get a microphone and then I'm like looking like where the H in the world are you supposed to put the microphone there's no hole there's a hole in the side of the camera and I'm like this is not a microphone hole it's for something else like a remote something I don't know but <sighs> I was like are you serious and I was like hesitating like should I should I not and this is an expensive camera so deep thought the other yeah I decided to return that one and I was so nervous because everything was opened I had everything with me except for um, the package for the free SD card and I still got a full refund and I was able to exchange with this I didn't get charged or anything because I read different stories on line and whatever so I've never returned anything at Best Buy before so I really didn't know how their return policy was so so that is the side story so let's begin with the new T6i Ken Rebel that I got 
so this is what the box looks like and it's the video creator kit as i mentioned earlier it comes with the rode microphone so for very good sun quality and let's see so it comes with the body of the camera the lens it's the um 18-55 millimeter that's what it usually comes with like the main one no extra lens the other one however did but it was like a longer lens and i didn't care for it so it came with a long lens and this but i don't care for it. i just want to take simple nice dslr pictures um and this is the road mic and i'm so happy because i almost thought it didn't come with any sd card the other one came with a free sd card but this comes with an sd card 32 gigabyte and i think that's recommended for any dslr um cameras so this is how big it is so let's um open it up I always struggle trying to open any box. I was trying to like open so smoothly, but it didn't work. But anyway, super excited. Are you excited? Okay, so comes with the SD card right here. This one is by Scandisk and Scandisk, Sandisk, and it's the Ultra 32 gigabyte. Woo -woo. And this is the microphone by what's it road road microphones very popular put this on the side and this is the camera itself this is the box it comes in up inside the other box so i'm gonna open it right now if i can is there tape no should be Ugh, struggle open so of course comes with the warranty and the manual which is a lot of mumbo jumbo and it's gonna give you a headache but just read some of the kind of basic information you'll need it and um, stuff so you can register your camera online and a CD and um, if your computer or laptop don't have a CD-ROM, um, you can download on their website, but it comes with a CD. So you can like connect the computer and stuff. Hey Shamar, I saw your message. And this is the strap. This is the USB cord to connect to your laptop. What else is here? And then this is the charger. Let's take that out. And it's a plug-in charger. Plug right here and just connect. Um, oh, what am I saying? This is where you put the battery. What else I got? And then this is the lens. It's the 1855 mil millimeter. Yeah, the other one that came in with the longer one, I can't can't remember exactly what size it is. Um, but someone told me it's for shooting like the moon and like long distances and stuff. So this is what it looks like. Each end comes with a cover. This side you screw, and this is the part where you attach to the camera. And then the lens is this way. It's um, just squeeze on the side and it opens up. Right here, actually. The middle. Squeeze. Just open. That's the lens. And squeeze again. Just put it back on. 
put that right here and really the lens just uh, fell from my table on the floor pray it's live oh gosh and um this is the battery all right almost there this is the body the actual camera itself I love your bubble wrap and then it's also wrapped in like this like soft cloth bag feels like um, dryer sheets and this is what it looks like it's really lightweight like the way it looks it's it's bulky and it seems super heavy but it's not it feels really comfortable and this is the cover and this is where you would put the lens let's put that so I can show you And it's probably some whatever left on the camera, on the batteries. Okay. So you just kind of align it and twist. And then if you want to release it, you just press this button, but make sure you hold both sides. Press this button and twist, and then it'll like unlock, and then you can take it out. So this is what it looks like with the lens. This is where you're gonna connect the microphone. This is the back side, all the buttons. And this is what I've been dying for. Ooh. Flip screen, so I can like see myself when I'm recording and it twist to the back and to the front. Isn't that beautiful? So this is my next favorite thing. It comes with the Rode microphone. This is the, what? Video Mic Go. It's lightweight on the camera and what else? Let's see. No battery required, lightweight. Ooh. I'm gonna open it up. So excited. Now I'm nervous because I just dropped the lens and both covers were still on, but then the other side kind of popped off. So, Boop. manual of course, and then this is the cord to connect one end of the microphone and the other end to the microphone port which I believe is right here, on the side here. There it is, right there. This is what it looks like. And this bottom part here just connects, or I guess you slide in here, I'm assuming, so yeah super excited you guys so I know the battery is not gonna be super full but I just want to show you how to put it in it's common sense but it's just nice to show because I like watching people open up things and just showing me exactly where it is instead of like looking at the book but this bomb part here this little you know pushing where you call it looks like that SD card what in the world? Whoa, this one is kind of different. Okay. This one looks different from the other one, so I gotta figure out where the SD card goes into. Here it is. Wow, it is different. Yeah, see, my bad. A little bit different from the T6 um, Rebel one. This is T6i. So, this is different. It looks on the other side instead of the bottom. So, SD card goes on the side if this is the one you got. Okay, so, what in the world? Is it this way? Okay. There. Right here. And if you want to inject it, just push it. See? Inject there, close it. 
I don't know why I didn't put on the same area. There must be a meaning behind it. Okay, I'm gonna put the camera in. <laughs> the battery, I can't talk you guys. There. Ooh, the light's on and then there's a off and on button and then camera all the way up there. So you're gonna turn it on. So excited. So this is what it looks like. It works. So I'm going to show you um, a before and after quality sound without the mic and with the mic and I'll um, add it to this clip. So, so this is what it looks like. This is the camera and then it comes with a flip screen and then you just got to set up the date and time or whatever, time zone. And then um, this is where the Rode microphone goes. It just clips on top of here. There, it looks like that. Isn't that amazing, you guys? Woo -hoo. All right, hope you guys enjoyed this video and I can't wait to start using this camera and just have better quality videos, so. This is super expensive, but I think it's well worth it if you want to get into YouTube and make nice quality videos and sound and take beautiful pictures. One reason why I got this camera is because I just can't take Ava to get any photos done professionally anymore because she always freaks out. If I get lucky, she doesn't, but the last time it was just too much and I'm like, I'm not going to push her so she's comfortable with family and I'll save money on um, pictures too. So, yay! All right, bye guys. Have a good one. Hey guys, so this is me without the mic, and I'm looking at myself. Very clear, very like 3D and crisp looking. It is on. What is it called? I'm still learning this. It's on the um, auto focus mode instead of manual. See, ooh, far away. Let's see if we can focus. We'll just play around. Canon. Will it focus that? I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, this is the sun quality without testing. One, two, three. I don't think we're close. This is me close. Yeah. Okay. I gotta run back and turn off the off button. So I might get like one of those, um, what is it? Remote, remote. So let's try with the mic in a minute. Hey guys, so I just connected the mic. A second ago, I totally forgot, well not forgot, but I recorded with the mic, but I didn't push it all the way in. So I heard no sounds. I'm like, oh no, it's broken. But hopefully this, will work. Um, you pretty much just um, connect the mic on top. There's a slot on top of the camera. I think it's called a horseshoe and you just slide it in. And then there's a dial where you just screw it like this and it gets tightened. And then you just um, put the little microphone port on each end end of the microphone and where your uh, microphone port is on the side of the camera. So hopefully the sound quality makes a difference. And um, yeah. I'm super stoked right now, you guys. So hopefully this time around, the microphone or plug-in is put in properly and I can hear myself. Woo! -woo.